Welcome to Penrose Library. Our four-story library is open 24-7 and gives us access to over 500,000 books here, as well as being part of the interlibrary loan system, which connects us to 26 other colleges and universities in the surrounding area with access to 22 million books within a couple of days. Hi, my name is Tazi. I'm a junior environmental studies politics major from Vashon Island, Washington. Here at Whitman College, I'm involved in Greek life. I work extensively in the admissions office and also partake in rock climbing and volunteering at the Blue Mountain Humane Society. Let's check out the library. Here at Penrose Library, we have a lot of great study options. Over here, we have our group tables, which is good for collaborative work and also has maneuverable whiteboards for students to use. If you need to sort of buckle down and work on your own, we also have individual cubbies that students can use, as well as private study rooms that students can reserve as a group or as an individual. Next, we're gonna check out the cafe. Welcome to Cafe 41, located in the bottom floor of the library. It's open from 8 p.m. to 1 a.m. and it offers salads, pasta, sandwiches, they're delicious. There are also baristas here who will make you anything from coffee to Italian sodas. They also have chocolate covered espresso beans, which have saved me so many nights I can't even count. Next we're going to head back upstairs. In addition to books, Penrose Library offers access to online databases for students to access journal articles for their research that they're doing here. Also, we have a technology services desk which is open till midnight in the library. Next, let's check out the Allen Reading Room. Welcome to the Allen Reading Room, more affectionately known as the Quiet Room. This is a great space to go if you really need to buckle down and get work done. And I also have students sort of hold you accountable for your silence as well. On the wall, you can see blue books, which are honors theses. Also, there is an infamous challenge called the Quiet Room Challenge, where if you are the last student in here, you get to write your name and your professor's name and other sort of delirious ramblings you're having very late at night. Luckily, I've never won, and I'm not trying to yet. 